so thought so far when I hold my hand here there especially there I can't really hold my hand there for too long that is really hot that is really hot and you hold your hand here mind you the wind's blowing the, the heat away for the fire you hold your hand there that's like holding your hand in front of you a car gas here. And that's just smoked on away now. The the bottom fire is basically gone. But you can't even put your hand in here because I think the bottom log bottom log is actually kicking out heat. Tremendous heat. And it, it actually goes along quite low down. So it'll go down low and then it'll rise up and ear ten. Now if that could sustain itself for five, six, seven hours, eight hours, more than that, why would you buy a wood stove if you could put this inside a barricade or a windbreak and keep the smoke from coming into your tent? That heat is fantastic, just right there. Probably about a foot away from the fire. You can hardly keep your hand there. And that's not in an enclosed space. If that was in the barricade, the smoke would be going right up, up, the, up there. You do get some heat here. Well, quite a lot of heat here. You more heat there. That's hot. You get a back heat at the sides. You don't get much heat at the, at the back at all. But that would, that would heat your tent great and if you could just move the logs forward every now and again to keep them going I don't think I would buy a wood stove for your tent because a wood stove you've got to cut the wood to, to size you've got to stock it up every 40 minutes an hour you can't stack them up too much because they choke up because the smoke pipe's too wee it's only like six centimetres and when I used to make stoves the pipe was four inches minimum with a dampener in it and even they didn't burn they, they couldn't burn all night it's impossible to get, have a wood stove to burn all night if it isn't big enough this seems like a better option but this might last hours and hours and hours with very minimum interference really just move the logs a bit forward and let it just smoulder away and give you heat it could be a great option but experimental times we'll see how it works we'll try the pine next but if ash works and burns a long, long time, then ash it will be.